So I promise, welcome to Fleetwood Town. Thank How you. does it feel to get it over the line? Yeah, it's, um, it's good. It's uh, taken obviously a few days and um, um, obviously it's obviously sad leaving. Obviously the Bahim is a team I was with before. I was, with there for, I was there for five years. So um, yeah, but it's obviously good to be here now and get a, get a deal done and uh, just assign to me and all the lads and um, get going. How did this move come about? Like, what were the stages that led up to your signing? Um, I kind of just got. I kind of just got. Um, I was in. So I think I was in Germany. We had a friendly against um, Union Berlin in the Bundesliga. We played against them, and then um, um, after the game, um, I just got. I saw a text. Um, agent just said um, Fleetwood are uh, very interested, and then um, uh, I didn't really think much of it at the time. And then, as the days got past, it just got more and more serious. And then, um, yeah, it's like I think by after about three days, it's might have decided like me going over here and like moving and all. So yeah, it was it happened very quick, but very didn't like not quick at the same time. It's a weird, weird feeling. But yeah, it's um, it's just good to be here now and get it done. Is it quite exciting that it was it was such a quick turnaround? Yeah, it was um, like um, me first hearing about it, and then getting told that like it's like it's getting closer it was very quick, and um, it was um, just very exciting and very just new. Like I've um, never left home before as well, so it's just a lot of feelings and a lot of emotions happened very fast as well. Yeah, but um, excited is probably the the, the biggest uh, feeling. Feeling now excited and just just. Um, just excited to get going. It's going to be weird for you, like you said, you've never left home before. Yeah. But it's a new challenge and yeah. one that I'm sure you'd be ready for. No, definitely, definitely, um, um, definitely something that I'm, I'm looking to do and obviously take the next step and obviously moving over, um, living alone f um, for the first obviously while I'm here. But um, it's a challenge I'm ready to take on and um, definitely, definitely. Um, intrigued and excited to see what has, uh, what's in store. So for our fans that may not know much about you, could you briefly explain your playing style? Yeah, I'd say um, uh, play, I can play up front or on the wings, preferably probably up front. I'm, um, uh, power, pace, um, strong. Um, that'll probably be the few words that probably a lot of people will describe about me. But yeah, um, just looking obviously to when we score goals and help the team. So with you explaining yourself as a striker there, you're joining like a long list with uh, another new signing, Callum Morton, this summer as well. Yeah. So that's got to be a good ch good challenge, knowing that there'll be competition for spaces. Yeah, away. definitely. Obviously, um, a squad is obviously meant to be a lot of players in it, and uh, it's good, obviously, all of us to be able to push each other, and ultimately it's uh, best for the team if all of us are pushing each other, all of us are giving 100% all the time where we're in, then it can only benefit the team. So, have you had any words with the the new gaffer Scott Brown yet? Yeah, I've, sp I've spoken to him a few times. He he's great, obviously. Yeah, grown up watching him. Uh, Celtic, obviously, he's a legend over there. So, yeah, it's um, it's great, obviously, to have him as a manager now, and obviously take a lot from him. Obviously, he's played a lot in the game and played at the highest level. So, um, just excited to work with him and work with uh, Steve and the the coaching staff. So we've mentioned this to the other signings as well. Like, do you think that you could probably take bits of their game? Obviously, not just Scott, but uh, Stephen Whitaker as well, the assistant, and all the coaching staff as well. Do you think you can grab bits of each of their games and then build on your own? Yeah, definitely. Um, they obviously have bags of experience, and they've been through through everything in their career. So, um, if we ever face challenges, what they faced before, then obviously you can uh, pull them to the side, obviously, and. Um, just gain so much knowledge and so much help from them. So yeah, it'll be good. It'd be good to definitely have them, um, have them as help and uh, grow, grow and learn from them. So just quickly going back on to the fact that you've never left home before, it, it'll be a brand new group for you. Yeah. And a brand new challenge, like we've we've previously said. So how do you feel like that's going to go? Like you go in, into a brand new dressing room. Yeah, yeah. It's um, I haven't been at my previous club for uh, four or five years now, so I haven't experienced this in, in a long time now. So. Yeah, just obviously you are you do get a bit anxious and a bit obviously nervous. I am a quiet lad as well, so um, but yeah, just I think I'm ready for the challenge now and 
something that um, I need as well to get out my comfort zone and um, and um, uh, hit the like hit the challenge head on first and obviously um, taking in a stride and just do well and obviously I'll grow as a person as well as a player.